Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you how properly layering vocals can enhance any song. And I'm going to show you the three layering techniques that you're going to need to know. As a producer or vocalist, you're going to need to know how to layer vocals because it's this added content to the vocal production that adds professionalism and life to any song or vocal. So in this video, we're gonna start with a professionally recorded vocal acapella, and I'm gonna show you how to layer it with doubles, harmonies, and ad-libs. Right before we jump into the tutorial, I'm officially announcing the start of the vocal series here on my channel. For the next 30 days, every video I upload will be centered around vocals, whether it's building songs with vocals, mixing vocals, hiring vocalists. This series will have you feeling like a pro when it comes to working with vocals. To make sure you take full advantage of the vocal series, go grab my brand new Eternal Vocals Pack, which contains every vocal sample that I will be using in every video of the series. This pack just dropped today and contains five professionally recorded vocal acapellas as well as over 450 vocal samples, MIDI patterns, vocal effects, and lush harmonies, doubles, and ad-libs. And because it's Black Friday, for a limited time only, we're adding in a second, never-before-seen vocal pack called Main Stage Vocals, which is two additional vocal acapella kits for free. All acapellas are 100% royalty-free, meaning you can create music with the acapellas and release that music commercially. Let's jump into the video. When it comes to layering vocals, I love to add layers to the hook of the vocal because it makes the vocals real wide and it just makes them come to life. Let's listen to our vocal. So our vocal right here is the pre-chorus and the verse. And then where it turns purple here is the hook. I want you to listen to how the song changes, but the dynamic of the vocal kind of just stays the same. Keep me in the dark, turn off the light, shut me down, I don't wanna fight. Try to make peace, put up the fire, but you just wanna gaslight. You could sign a war inside my head. Now I'm overthinking everything. She is so talented that even without layers, it sounds pretty cool. But watch what happens when we bring in some layers. The first layers that I'm going to bring in are called doubles. Doubles are an exact repeat of the main vocal. So they're the same octave and the same notes. The main hook sounds like this. You could start a war inside my head. And then double number one sounds like this. You could start a war inside my head. So you could hear it's the same words, it's so saying the same way, but you could tell that it's a different take. You can't just duplicate the main vocal either and make it work as a double because you'll run into phasing issues and it'll sound weird. The second double sounds like this. You could start a war inside my head. Now we have three different takes. So here's what we do when we have a main vocal and then two doubles. We put one double into the left ear and then the other double into the right. Now you don't always have to do this, but it sounds pretty good and it's worth trying. So now our hook vocal sounds like this. You could start a war inside my head. Instead of this. You could start a war inside my head. Hear how much electricity just popped in to the energy of this vocal? You could start a war inside my head. <laughs> That's just so good. The next thing I always request when I hire singers is harmonies. Harmonies are the same words, but they're sang on different notes that harmonize very well. Typically, this is done as a third or a fifth harmony. Here's a high pitch harmony. You could start a war inside my head. And here's a low harmony. You could start a war inside my head. And if we mix these with our main vocal, we get this. You could start a war inside my head. They kind of all work together and just add electricity. This is with our panned doubles now. You could start a war inside my head. You kind of get that full choir effect. It's not like 100% a choir but it sounds so full and so awesome. We have one more layer. It's a octave up from the main vocal stem. You could start a war inside my head. And it gives a nice whistle to the original stem. You could start a war inside my head. So now watch what happens when we play the music and all of these layers make that vocal come to life. Me in the dark, turn off the light, 
shutting me down, I don't wanna fight Try to make peace, put up the fire, but you just wanna gaslight You could start a war inside my head Now I'm overthinking everything, things I never said <laughs> Isn't that electric? The last thing you're going to want to request when you hire a vocalist or you're working with your own vocalist or you're recording your own vocals is ad-libs. Ad-libs are sporadic spurts of words and phrases that you try anywhere. So I asked for some recordings of ad-libs and the ad-libs I received sound like this. Yay. Something like that is candy for a music producer because I put a lot of reverb on it and I also put some echo on it now let's give it a listen Yay. game over you could do anything you want with that so what I did is I just threw it in the background of our hook and now listen to everything come to life I'm just gonna play one pattern here so we can hear everything now listen to that ad lib Fill up the atmosphere of this vocal. Try to make peace, put up the fire, but you just wanna gaslight. You could start a war inside my head. Now I'm overthinking everything, things I never said. Yeah, you could start a war inside my head. You manipulate me to get your revenge. All those beautiful vocals and layers, by the way, are included in Eternal Vocal Pack. Here's another example. This vocal is on the main stage vocal pack, which is included with the eternal vocal pack. This is one of the most mystic vocals I've ever heard. Just listen to this. I feel like I'm afraid to say how I feel, to know I let you down. Cause late night. One of the greatest sounds I've ever heard. Now let's listen to the transition of this vocal out of the verse into the hook without layers. Here's where the hook starts and here's what you're gonna hear first. I'm chasing somebody who won't ever ease the pain but I don't want half of your heart, heart, heart. Now you already know with the register that goes that high, layers are gonna blow this vocal up. Let's check out some of the layers he gave us starting with the doubles. When I request doubles, I always request two doubles. So I could get one that goes into the left ear and then another one that goes into the right ear. Here's double number one. I don't want help. It's an exact repeat of the main vocal, but it's a different take. Here's double number two. I don't want help. It sounds gorgeous when they're on top of each other like that, but it sounds even more gorgeous if we just push them all the way to the right and then the left. And then we can bring in our main vocal and watch what happens. But I don't want <laughs> it's just like, ah, oh, it's so electrifying. Let's see what else we got in here. So this is a nice harmony. Okay, so we have two of the same harmonies. We could do so much with just that sound. So I'm gonna mute one because I don't need both. And I'm just gonna add a bunch of reverb to it and... You already know what I'm about to do with this one. All right, so we have our main stem that airy ad-lib harmony thing and then we have both of our doubles one in the right ear and then one in the left ear i have one pattern playing so we can actually hear what's going on here let's listen to this magic i'm chasing somebody who won't ever ease the pain but i don't want half of your heart 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 you can have it back. Wow. It's like that mystifying Rufus the Soul or Lane 8 sound. Let me know if you guys listen to those artists. 
Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Don't forget, check out the Eternal Vocal Pack below, and you can even try it for free below as well. See you guys in the next video.